entrepreneur and impact investor, Flo Heinz, who joins us now from our Seapoint studios. Flo, good morning. Welcome to uh, Morning Live and South Africa. Good morning to you. Now, who is Halstead uh, aimed at and what is it? Well, we started Halstead because I live in London and we have just noticed that there's an extraordinary demand for African products across the globe. If you look from the American retailers to European purchasers, the whole world is craving for product that's not only inspired by African artists mm -hmm. and, and uh, people, but also that is actually made and manufactured in African countries. What? So what we decided to do is to look at, you know, if for instance, in the first case, Ardmore ceramic, and take that as an inspiration to then translate it onto more modern, contemporary design work that we could export around the world. Why is the design endeavor the best place to launch Halstead? Well, it's 2014. Cape Town is the you know, design city of the year. Um, the Indaba is really the sort of center for African design products. So it just made sense as an African company that predominantly is based in South Africa to launch this year in Cape Town. Now, Halstead is inspired by the late Wonder Boy Ngumalo. Speak to us about that. Yeah, so Wonderboy was an extraordinary artist that Faye worked with uh, for many years. He unfortunately passed away in 2008. And born in 1975, he really went through the whole transition with Mandela and wrote a lot of lyrics about, you know, Mandela, our president. But he also was obviously affected by his life um, having HIV and, and later developing AIDS. So his artwork wasn't just about being creative designs. It was also about expressing his emotions with the country, with the disease. And when he passed away in 2008, Faye really decided to uh, devote a lot of attention to his work and therefore it became obvious that he should be really the pinnacle of our first collection. And how do you plan to uh, take Ardmore um, into the global market? So, so the Halstead company does exactly that. So we will discover companies like Ardmore. We will then develop their products into something that we think will fit also in a Johannesburg penthouse or in mm -hmm. a New York loft. And then what we will do is both via the internet and we'll create an e-commerce platform but also with working through retail and wholesale channels we will then distribute these products most likely US, Europe and then possibly Asia as well eventually. Now speak to us about the creative team behind Halstead. Who were you involved with? Well, obviously, Faye is very, very hands-on because yeah. in this particular case, it's the Ardmore collection, so it has her name over it. And we had another extraordinary man called Rulof van Weyck, who is an old colleague of mine from the past in, in South Africa, who worked with Faye to interpret the Wonder Boy designs into what we now have in the clip that you've just shown us um, on the product range. How do you think South Africans will receive Halstead? Well, I don't have to think anymore because we launched on Monday and on Thursday uh, we had the buyers and I was overwhelmed. I mean, I thought that, you know, for the international market, this is interesting, but it totally took me by surprise how many of the larger South African retailers were so excited that this was something fresh. It was new. It wasn't this sort of art and craft product that they've seen before. So I think you'll see a lot more of us. And what is the best part about being part of this project? Well, I've, I've done many companies, but I've never actually done a company before where I personally really, really enjoy the product. Yeah. So that's one thing. But the second thing is, you know, there is an element of just creating a responsible manufacturing business in Africa that really attracts me. And I think if we can really make this work, it would be such a great test case to show that you can produce extremely high quality product that the whole world can purchase from this country. And you don't always have to go to India and China for your manufacturing sources. All right, Fleur, thank you so much for talking to us. Uh, thank you uh, for paying us a visit and enjoy the design endeavor. Thank you very much for having me.